Hey yo, what's going on with it once again? Bros, women, bronies, and Pegasus, so tacos, hiki, komodos out there. This is the one, the only, of course, Mr. Nintendo Sony Free 2011, AK Cruising Guy 2009. Of course, you guys are investing in this channel. Double check out freedomnetwork.com. Of course, some of you on that. If any people are interested in that business partner program, best partner ever had, all like a shit. Links in the description box down below, notation outside. If any people are interested in that business partner program, best partner ever had, all like a stuff. And without further ado, let's begin. Let's get this started right about now. So, Hopefully I have to do two, two parts of this video. I apologize if I do in advance, ladies and gentlemen. So here it is. GamerZone. This is from GameZone.com. Um, and the person that actually wrote this article was um, Tatiana Moore. So shout out to her for making this um, new rumor speculation. This was on April 19th. Oh, that's actually today. Okay. So uh, I actually thought this came out on a Sunday, but whatever. I'm actually a lot more earlier on this than I thought I was. <laughs> I get brownie points for that, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully I do. And it's okay if you don't want to give me any. <laughs> so it says, rumor, PS4.5 is codenamed Neo. Specs and details leak, confirmed by alternate sources. Oh, and on uh, small sided news, I was going to do a video on this. I was a little bit too lazy to do it. Because I hate Microsoft or um, Xbox One or any of that shit. It just doesn't fancy my taste very much. It doesn't really like go with my style, but whatever. I still do a couple articles every now and then on it. But I actually heard that there was like some fake um, leak version of um, the Xbox One. <laughs> It was like 1.5 or whatever, and a lot of people were comparing it to some old school Sega Genesis or Green Dreamcast system that's turned on the bottom like this, <laughs> but open in half. That's really, really crazy. I, I'm pretty sure I could this pretty much it, me and like millions of other people that are actual gamers and confirm that right now. That's confirmation that it's fake. Completely false. There's no way in hell that's real. And if it is, <laughs> shame on Microsoft for um, not... Um, <laughs> having their security stuff leaked out. It's very, very unfortunate getting their new sources leaked out like that. So, let's continue on. So it says, what will Microsoft bring to the table after hearing about this? Previous rumors in the upgraded PS4 console suggest that the console will be priced anywhere between $399 and $399. <laughs> Same thing, $400. Will feature a GPU twice as powerful as the standard TS4 and will upscale games to 4k new sources new sources have been revealed themselves through giant bomb via leak documents which have been confirmed by digital foundry who, who claims to have the access to the very same documents these leaks files these leaked files detail the hardware specifics specifications excuse me for the new ps4 how sony expects to make the console work and its apparent and its apparent code name. Before we dive in, take a look at what we are supposed to actually don't no, take a look at the supposed specs for the console code name Neo. And the guys probably already saw it already, but I'm just gonna read to you anyway. So it says original PS4, the CPU, GPU, and the memory gigs are eight Jaguar cores at 1.6 gigahertz, AMD CGN 18 CU at 800, 800 excuse me, MHZ. And then the ones on the side say a Jaguar cores at 2.1 GH. Improved AMD GCN at 36 CUs at 911 MH. AGB GDDR, excuse me, GDD R5 176 GBS gigabytes. I'm pretty much pretty sure that's what it stands for, what it's specificating. AGB GDDR, that might be gigs of RAM, I'm not sure. G, GDDR5 218 gigabytes. So it says how the console is expected to work. The upgraded PS4 will offer better performances, power, and graphics that the current version of the PlayStation 4 does not acquire. The documents suggest that the Neo will feature the rumor 4K resolution for games that support 4K without losing without losing out on frame rates. According to the documents, Sony will not Compromise frame rate for resolutions. Games must meet or exceed the frame rate of the original PS4 games. Sony does not intend to split the PlayStation community with two consoles. There will be no... Oh, and then they, they really highlight these, these um, words. So pay attention. He's very much all my little um, ladies and gentlemen out there, my grown-ass men and women, and, of course, my younger viewers out there watching. This is quote. Actually, there's no quote on it. I'm sorry I made that part up, guys. So it says, no Neo-specific games and no separation in online play will be between the two consoles. 
In addition to that, the upgraded consoles will not feature exclusive PlayStation VR modes. How the games will be affected. Starting this October, every, every PS4 game will need to ship with two mods, Base Mod and Neo Mod. The Base Mods will run on the original PS4 with no alterations. While the Neo Mod, on the other hand, will offer exchange graphics, excuse me, enhanced graphics and performances on the upgraded Sony PlayStation 4. Games that release in the late September will require day one patches to upgrade the Neo worthy titles. Unfortunately, shipping a game with two versions sounds like adding sounds like adding additional development to devel development time for the PlayStation games. And it says for Tatiana Morris, I might as well read this really quick. I work here, so at least I've got that going for me. Catch me on Twitter. <laughs> I might follow her on Twitter. I don't fucking know. But other than that, <laughs> overall thoughts, using opinions, ladies and gentlemen. Sounds like I'm going to be a judge like the final verdict. Guilty, not guilty. How does the jury plead? <laughs> I'm not any of that. Um, not really that much of an important person anyways. But other than that. And if you think I'm an important person, thank you very much. But um, I'm kind of flattered a little bit. <laughs> I'm not a god or anything. Even if I had a million subscribers, I still would be the same way that I am right now. But, excluding all that BS aside... <laughs> actually, that's not BS. That's the truth. I don't know if this is going to push their project. But like how many people remember when Sony was um, last year. I think earlier last year. Or late 2014. The year before. When everyone was saying that Sony PlayStation, um, the VR, virtual reality headset, is going to be called Project Morpheus. That was our code name for a little bit until they eventually became as what well, we all know today as the Sony um, PlayStation VR. And that's it. And um, uh, excluding all that. <laughs> Man, um, I think, it, I forgot what his name was. I think it's Mr. Yamashita. Sonio Matashita. I don't know what his name was. One of the CEO of Japanese presidents for Sony. And the game developing, um, the gaming division. Because there's so many different um, divisions for Sony. Obviously, they have the movies. You know, some people think that those are complete shit. It is what it is. Everyone's totally inside to their own opinion. I will not argue or speculate at all in the slightest. There's that. And, and once in a while I might. And then there's, there's a little music industry. And then of course they end up having a lot of their technology industry. I'm not sure if they have a laptop industry. I wouldn't be surprised they do. And of course they got their headsets. A lot of their um, software, hardware like divisions. And then of course, real big ones. The gaming one, obviously. Surprise! There's no like Sony pictures for like um, actually no, I take that back, for like um TV series and all that, like for Netflix or Hulu, etc. Or a new one I just heard about this past Sunday called Vessel, which I've never heard of in my life until I was watching one of um, I think G Noggin's videos, aka Lockstein, when he was talking about being on Vessel and he was promoting the shit, absolute shit out of it. But uh, it is what it is. I have no issue with that whatsoever. You know, he actually does that for a living full time. Me, I just do this part time because. I actually do have, I'm not trying to like shit on anyone's parade or put anyone uh, under the pedestal or in the hot seat or as some people would might say, um, <laughs> put anyone, um, what's it called? I'm not shitting under their parade and what's another one? I'm not putting anyone to shame or anything or trying to like put them down or anything like that in a negative light. But I will say this, um, some people actually do this for a full time living. Me, I just do this shit part time just for a little bit every now and then. I actually do have two real life jobs out there that I make a living with. So, to provide for, for myself and my roomies, of course. Of course, they got their own job. Thank goodness they haven't lost any of them. Whew. Would be fucked if that happened. But, well, to God, that day never comes. Um, excluding all that. <laughs> man. Man, oh man, oh man. What can I say? Um, we got a lot of um, time in our hands. I, it's, it's either going to be October, November. October, November are usually the two biggest months next to half of, half of the month, December, because that's usually when Christmas time comes around, even though some people don't celebrate it. You know what? I respect and value their opinions. <clears throat> to a certain degree, of course. But, yeah, aside from all that, <laughs> oh, man, what can I say? I'm really, really flabbergasted with this type of um, information coming out into the spotlight. Nonetheless, ladies and gentlemen, and I got to get my drink because I'm... My throat is really killing me. As far as that all goes, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we got a lot of time in our hands to make this thing into a reality. And that's going to be, what, it's almost, April's almost done. So we only got less than two weeks of this month. So that means half of April or less than April. May, June, July, August, September, October. Actually, no, five and a half months until um, 
this information, news information, does end up coming to pass and goes from fantasy and speculation and rumors to possible reality. I don't know. It's up in the fucking air, folks. Um, aside from that, hmm, I don't know how they're going to make it a lot faster as far as Blu-ray DVDs go. Because usually that's why I use my PS3 and my PS4 for most of the time is just for movies and DVDs. The older ones, of course. Standard sets. And I still do take care of both of those systems, obviously. I clean them, like, every fucking weekend. I don't clean them physically with water or anything. I use special little, like, <laughs> um, special little, like, hand wipes, as, as the saying goes. I don't know what else they can do. I really don't know whether different, like, um, outreaches they're going to be doing most of the time for Sony. I'm not sure if they're going to be, like, improving the PlayStation Plus, because some of that, sometimes, half the time, that system does suck ass. They really got to improve their internet skills, man. They really, really fucking do. Sony, if any corporate executives, I doubt if you're ever watching this video, but if any of you guys are in, like, the graphical design divisions or any of the internal, like, affairs or di divisions or any of those type of little mini divisions that Sony has, because they're a billion-dollar company. There's no way in hell they're going bankrupt. And they do, that'll be, like, the biggest thing that's happened since, I don't know, sliced fucking pizza. <laughs> Many people get that reference. Shout out to you if you do. It's from a YouTube subscriber. Not a subscriber, a YouTube content creator out there. Does food reviews. <laughs> but other than that, huh. Shit, bro. I mean, what else can I say about it? Um, number one, they got a lot of their work ahead of them. Hopefully they don't bite off more than they can chew and they don't, um, fucking their self up in their positions. Yeah, the internet, um, the ISP providing services... Hopefully they fix that out because we don't want another um, bullshit hacking thing like the Lizard Squad to end up um, taking over Sony and um, shutting them down for like a week until they get bored. It's like, oh, let's move on to something else to hack into another system account, which would be one of the most worst devastating things. Again, it would I'd be like the third time that happened because I remember it was either 2007 and 2010 when it first happened, and it happened again, I think, in 2011 or 2014. And uh, unfortunately, um, if it happens again, that's going to be really, really... Um, Another big slap in the face from Sony. Um, from Lizard Squad to Sony. That's not going to be a good look on them. It's just going to make their a lot of their um, their public visual, like, their public viewpoints and all that very, very um, shady, in my own personal opinion. And then last but not least, the thing that Sony really needs to improve with this 4.5 AK Project Neo is that, <laughs> just like how Nintendo did with their 3DS and new 3DSs, make faceplates for them. Even though they, they make permanent ones on the inside out, not everyone's a computer technician, CPU, like I am. Well, I'm not a really one of those. Even though I got my stuff for computer engineering, but I never did nothing with it. But, aside from that, <laughs> oh, Lord and fucking up. And really, they really got to um, work better on the mic controls. I'll make it like how the Wii U Pad was and then their Sony PS4 giant clunky um, um, gamer controller was. Make it a little bit more efficient. Make it a lot more sturdy. That way it falls on the concrete floor. Make it like into like a rubber, like... Um, durable thing make it extremely durable and extremely like hardcore or if it does fall on the floor it won't shatter or won't crack a little bit or you have to like you know, unscrew all the wires and put everything back together and re-screw it and um redesign it to the way that it initially was and that's pretty much all i have to say ladies and gentlemen links in the description box down below annotation on site if you want to read this article on your own time and then there's a couple of youtube videos on might as well link in there as well and i'm out of here Peace out once again, bros, women, bronies, and packages. We'll talk to you, commanders out there. We'll see you when I see you. You guys have a good day, have a good night, wherever you are around the world. Don't drink smoke at the same time. Don't think I'm reckless. Keep it calm, keep it cool, keep it chill, keep it liquid out there. And until then, next time, guys, peace out, ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned, more videos coming soon. Brand new videos on the channel almost every single day. Stay in the grind, stay, stay safe, stay healthy, be easy, be easy, yourself. Peace out, my nice sauerkraut. I'm gone again, a lot of here. Stay tuned, more future guns on the channel. Stay tuned, more updates. See you guys soon. Stay safe. Stay tuned for more future videos on this channel. And I will talk to you guys later. Peace, glades, goodbye. And um, I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully you guys, either you're positive or negative about this news, leave in the comment section below. I really don't ask for comments that much, but would love to hear you guys' opinions. Totally down for that. Peace and goodbye. See you later.